In episode 226, we cover the topic of why haven't I heard from my advisor recently? Welcome to the Maluli Asset Show. I'm your host, Tom Maluli, and this is episode 226. Thanks for tuning in. Nobody, especially in our industry, works for free. So I'm always a little surprised when folks say, I don't pay my advisor anything. If you're not paying your advisor a fee, then please understand that the cost of working with your advisor is baked in the cake. It's in the investments that you have with that advisor. That's how they're getting paid. A very large brokerage firm that everybody would recognize on the planet has announced that starting next year, any money that their advisors, their brokers manage for households with less than $250,000, those brokers will no longer be paid. Another large firm, there's only a couple of them, so we can figure this out, a very also large firm, brokerage firm, announced that starting next year in 2021, advisors won't be able to earn compensation unless 75% of their customers have at least $250,000. You need to understand something. 20 years ago, uh, firms started saying to uh, advisors that if your clients have $25,000 or less, they, uh, you're not going to get paid on it and you're, you should consider moving those accounts to a call center. Along with that, the average payout ratio for commission stockbrokers has continued to drop. It's now around 19%. So if you do, if you're a commission stockbroker and you do a million dollars in gross commissions, you're going to earn around $190,000. Still pretty good, but understand that when I left that universe almost 20 years ago, the payout ratio was double that, it was 37, 38% on average. So brokers today need to work twice as hard to make the same amount of money. So please understand that we're not saying that what the, uh, the model that exists in brokerage communities is wrong. There's nothing wrong with it, it's just different and you need to understand how your advisor gets compensated. That's so, so important. Our approach is a little different than what you'd find in the brokerage world. We work with clients of all sizes. For clients, and it's outlined on our website, for clients at $250,000 and over, we have a fee schedule, and it's, the fee is based on the assets that we manage. For clients with less than $250,000, we have a monthly subscription plan and all the details are on the website. But the main thing is no matter which fee schedule you're on, all of our clients start the same way. They all start with planning. We put together a financial plan for our clients. That's not only for you, our clients, but it's also for us to get a better gauge of where you're at on your financial life cycle and where you're going and how much risk is really appropriate for you. So understand, there's a lot of different compensation models in our universe, but nobody works for free. That's the message for episode 226. Thanks again for tuning in.